What's up everybody, Jordan here, back with another YouTube video. Sunny North Dakota in the middle of September for some reason. We're having beautiful weather and the soybeans are changing super fast. That's kind of what's gonna be coming up in the next couple of weeks here at the farmland. Across the road from me are soybeans. You probably can't see that, but they're pretty brown. You might hear I'm a little bit stuffed up. I think it's just a cold uh, that I kind of had over the weekend, but nothing more than a little bit of a stuffy nose. So hopefully that's all it is and uh, feel better now and get back to out in the field, get back to work. Today, we're gonna be doing a little bit more of the same that we were doing last video, which is mowing with that woods mower. This won't be the whole video. Of course, I'll film a little bit more to get some more content for you. Wanted to give you guys an update uh, some special friends, a surprise for the channel is going to be coming to our farmhouse. And uh, I'll let you guys in on that in about November. So be sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss that. The shed has some updates and uh, gave you guys a little look. Not anything too crazy, but stuff that needed to be done. This little door seal on here needed to be put in. There was a big gap, which was from the bottom of this board up to the door. And I filled that in the other day and put this on. And then also this little ramp for the surprise that's coming in a couple months. Other than that, things have been pretty good. Done some service stuff around the yard. Worked on that mowing project, disc a little bit. Combined some barley patches. Been pumping right along here on the farm. Let's go to work. Mowing with the woods mower again today and we'll see what's in store for tomorrow. Welcome to another video. Piper. So just because we're doing the same thing today with this woods mower doesn't mean that that's all we've been doing. I listed off a whole bunch of things before the intro and we are in a different field here today on the other side of the road from where we were last time. Last time, although I know this is all flat, you probably can't tell the difference, it's across the road there and we actually disked that whole field as well on Sunday morning. Got pretty much all of it done before the Vikings came on and I got to suffer through that. Did mow all the weedy patches in there, sprayed that field, and we're pretty happy with how it turned out with this woods mower. It seemed like the weeds really drying up. They're not, you know, obviously a lot there because they're all chopped up. So this did a good job of pulverizing those. And then the disc, the sprayer, the combo of that took care of the rest. This will be good. So that's why we're doing another field, actually the third one, I think now with this mower. So I'm gonna be headed through all the different parts of this field, chopping up some of these weeds, and you've seen it, you know what's to come. Let's go. everybody want to jump out of the tractor here for a little bit because we're just continuously mowing here it's these weeds right here that we're cutting down and there's a couple big patches in this field it's just kind of a big field but I'm just kind of driving around looking for them kind of a good day I should have brought the drone could have scouted out where the weeds are and gone over to those spots but either way I wanted to pop out of the tractor here for a second to show you guys the soybeans because I thought I should do something in this video other than just film what I did last video these are some soybeans that we have, and actually these ones on the edge are a little bit more green than in the field. So we're gonna carefully kind of step through here, see if we can get to the middle a little bit. This is more standard. So kind of look right down the row here. You can see Piper's coming to see as well. Um, we're really turning fast. And it seems like every day these turn a little bit more. We did have some rain last week. Uh, it was just kind of a light rain, but besides that, been pretty hot for September. 
been relatively dry all year and uh, yeah you know it's green one day yellow the next day and it seems like now it's looking brown so I'm sure we'll be combining soybeans the next couple of weeks which uh, will be good so that'll be exciting for the farm channel and getting even closer to the end of harvest we have soybeans we have sunflowers that are down to the south a little bit otherwise all the other crops are done uh, which took up most of the time but we're in this waiting game again for the beans let's go girl ripping down the dirt road back to the farmhouse seven o'clock time for some dinner maybe some pizza see you guys tomorrow all right everybody welcome to the next day friday september 17 i think i'm out here with the 8870 and the disc hitting a couple weedy patches today so mowing is one strategy to knock out these weeds Disking is another. This is the new disc we got last year. Um, so glad to be able to use that. This is the kind of stuff I am going to be disking. It's this spot and one other spot today. Just some weedy stuff. Some more of these big weeds, but a little bit too much to mow, honestly. And there's also a little slough in here that I'm gonna also have to take care of. Kind of feel like flying the drone today. It's a little bit windy, but uh, not a lot of trees to bump into, so. Enjoy. Alright everybody, made it home. Killed some koshas today. That's pretty much what this video is about. Mowing these weeds off, digging them up with the disc, doing a little maintenance work on our fields before soybean harvest. Things are getting ready, things are getting dried out here this fall. We're having beautiful weather here in North Dakota with some good fall weather, late summer weather. And this will put another video in the books. Thank you for watching, subscribing, all that YouTube stuff, and I'll see you guys next time.